while USA Today exposed the illegal wiretapping of at least 52,000 Californians, you probably missed the synthesizer for multiple players, the headband for the blind, and bioengineering for your singing voice. Welcome to In Case You Missed It, where reaching the crazy high notes Mariah Carey could reach in the 90s <laughs> is nearly as cool as knowing she does not get out of bed to record voiceovers. Why am I here? I can't sing. That's why. Great news, everyone. Doctors can now give you a new set of vocal cords that don't come from dead people. A team from University of Wisconsin Medical School developed a way to grow them in the lab using bioengineering. Now that's something to stand up and crow about. <laughs> Haptic feedback, aka that vibration your phone makes as you tap out passive aggressive tweets, could soon help blind people make their way through the world, white cane not necessary. The idea is that the Centiri proximity sensing headband will buzz to help people avoid obstacles. It detects the environment with infrared depth sensors and can connect to a smartphone app to safely guide you from point A to B. Try to go towards where you don't feel vibrations. So where, where you're feeling vibrations, feel vibrations is where there's a wall or something there. It. Just keep the guide dogs, okay? The world needs that. Aww. Or guide ponies. Did you know that was a thing? Amazing. Rock band fiends can now have multiplayer fun, but also make real music, because that's not what you're doing. Researchers from Queen Mary London Center for Digital Music created a collaborative synthesizer called the Kaleidoscope. Up to four people can control the device at once, recording sounds from instrument inputs or microphones. Floor sound. And you then can manipulate the sound. Once the grains of sound are made, they're reorganized and mapped to the keyboard. Lots of shut-ins and their cats are gonna be happy now. And now, TLDR, where we do the week's reading for you because we like using emojis with abandon. Sony's adding PS2 emulation to the PS4. Anonymous declared war on ISIS. RDO is shutting down. New York's Attorney General is going after Yahoo's daily fantasy sports as part of the FDDK investigation. And hoverboards are illegal in New York City. First New York, then the world, because those things are annoying. 